Let me let it out. All right, reel it in. The original owner of the boat, her name was Pamela, so we always we kept the name. The business may be called Lady Pamela II, but they have six boats total. There's the Lady Pamela II, of course, along with the Lady Pamela one, three, four, five, and six. Where the boats are docked, they're very close to the ocean, so you don't spend a lot of time riding out here and you get mostly all fishing time. I come to Fort Lauderdale a lot, and the nice thing about fishing here is you don't have to go far to catch fish. It's, uh, you know, you go one to three miles off the beach, and the action's all right there. You know, another thing is, you know, you got nice flat seas uh, on most cases, and um, you can go out for half a day and get your money's worth. When fishing aboard one of the many boats of Lady Just Pamela II, licenses, bottled water, and sunscreen are supplied. All of your bait and tackle needs are provided by the crew, and they also make sure there are plenty of coolers and ice for the trip. But the most important thing they provide to each charter is experience. Our whole crew has been, we have uh, 10, 10 employees, and everybody's a captain that works for our company. So the captain can do the mate's job, the mate can do the captain's job. Well, you can get mahi-mahi, king mackerel, bonita, wahoo, sailfish. This time of year, you know, starting November all the way through April, we do lots of kite fishing. Kite fishing, we use live bait, and we catch lots of sailfish, a few marlin. We also do a lot of sword fishing year round. You come March through like, you know, August, that's our shark season. We catch a lot of big game sharks. We know there are all kinds of fish to catch, but the major question is, can we catch fish? Whenever we went out with Captain Dave, really liked it because he's real close to the inlet. He was one of the closest charter boats. It took us five minutes before we started setting out lines. My first question when I called them was, am I guaranteed to catch fish within first half an hour or so, you know, of being out there, we, we were, had fish striking the lines and it was really great. Left middle, left long, left middle, left long. We asked about what the probability was going to be to catch some fish and he said, no, we guarantee you to catch something and that was great. There he is, jumping over there. <laughs> jumping at the boat. Right. Come ahead, I got a big belly in the line. The fish were going off here, there. Two sailfish come up, we end up getting one of them. And man, what a fight. You think this is a fish? Ha! <laughs> it's a fish, all right, but it's the bait. As soon as these sailfish come up, I mean, unbelievable. You know, it's just uh, on fire. I mean, the action, the boat speeds ahead, right? You know, the lines come up everywhere, right? Everyone's running around trying to figure out what to do next. You know, and everyone's screaming and yelling, and man, excitement.